The high school football, several East Tennessee teams have made it to the final week, all in search of becoming the next state champion. And to the surprise of absolutely no one, the Alcoa Tornadoes are back for a state record eighth straight championship appearance. It's really special because I don't think there's anywhere like this in across the U.S. really. Anytime you can, you can make it to the state championship, it's always good. Alcoa is one of the winningest high school football teams not only in the state, but in the country. Now doing something no other team in Tennessee has accomplished, appearing in an eighth straight championship game. It means a lot. We have a streak going and I'm just looking to continue it. It means a lot. I love, I love this whole team. It's a lot. It's my senior year. It's crazy. Leading the way to historic heights is first year head coach Brian Nix. Yeah, I can live with that. You just want to try to contribute to making these kids better people. You know, you, you feel like if, if you make them better men, you invest in them, then they're going to play hard for you. The field's going to take care of itself. This year's team has outscored its opponents 591 to 188, and it's the fifth straight year a Tornado's team has one or fewer losses on the season heading into the title game. There's going to be some diversity, and that's why we practice the way they do. We do. It's why we train the way we do. It's why our practices are strenuous. They're mentally strenuous because we want our kids to be able to deal with stress. We want our kids to be able to deal with adversity because that's what life's about. This year features a rematch of the 2021 championship game. Alcoa and East Nashville will meet for the second time, and these tornadoes know it'll take their best shot to repeat as champions. They were really good last year, and I'm really expecting a dogfight, a war, okay. so All we're right, just preparing this week for it. Which side do I want to run my Joining Alcoa and Chattanooga are West and Anderson County. West is a fantastic storyline. They handed Alcoa its only loss on the year, also defeating Maryville and taking down the defending 5A champions in Powell last round. Now they'll face Paige for the 5A title. The Rebels enter the game undefeated for the first time in program history. And how about Anderson County, an undefeated team going into the championship game? They've won their last five region title games and are now in the title game for the first time. They'll meet Pearl Cone and we'll hear from both of these teams later in the week.